Hello, everybody, and thanks for tuning in to another rebar straightening episode of Browie's Best to Ma uh, Mess to Mansion. Here we have Miss Brittany in the house, who's joined our friends Darren, the electrician, and Taryn, the electrician. Say hi, guys. Hello. All right. <laughs> yeah, they're finishing up the wiring here in the kitchen and the dining room. Everything's kind of coming together. We got a whole big shipment of shiplap um, wood showing up on Monday morning that we're going to be putting in several different places. We got a heck of a deal on it, so we're going to take advantage of that. God is good, no doubt about it. Anyway, we had told you we had to strip out all the all the plaster in this room that was on the brick because it was just too much of a mess, and it was all falling off anyway. This is going to be one of those shiplapped walls right here. We're going to keep these, but we're going to close them permanently. And then in here, our good man Whitey has made a lot of progress in the bathroom area. I don't know if you guys can see this very well, but yeah, this is all getting closed in. Everything's coming together, folks. Exciting times. And again, this wall here, this is all getting knocked down to create one big area with this and this. This whole wet bar area is going to look a little different, but fairly the same. And this wall here will just be completely gone. We're just trying to keep the dust down for the two ladies that are actually living upstairs and keeping an eye on it for us while we're living here, I mean, until we actually move in. So this wall here on this side is gonna be completely sheetrock now. There won't be the pocket door to see on this side, it'll just be sheetrocked. Gonna be building some nice shelves around here. And then, yep, this is all, of course the brick is gonna stay open just like everywhere else. This is going to be nice. This is going to be nice. And I believe we are going to put a uh, or not concrete, but a glass block right here in this window right here. Got some lovely blue carpet that's going to be going on the floor here. It's going to be awesome. This big area out here, the office and wet bar area is going to have a blue and white checkerboard floor carrying some, um, probably some white tile here if we don't just continue the tile inside the bathroom out into this area. But since there's gonna be like a bench and stuff like this out here, I'm thinking about making this more natural floor. So we'll see where that goes. Anyway, that's all I got for today. Love to hear any uh, advice, comments, Decorating tips anybody might have to help us with this place. And you know, this is just the first floor. We still have the whole second floor to do and the apartment next door. We still have, here, let me walk you through real quick. As you come through this little area, come out this door this is the wraparound porch that you can see from the street gonna be a whole bunch of shiplap boards right there tomorrow a hundred of them this old apartments was probably the uh servants quarter or maybe a maybe a garage or carriage house back in the day i'm not sure but uh yeah that's gonna be an apartment we're going to put a really nice man cave downstairs, looking area, maybe a pool table. Going to be very rustic down here because there's a place for a um, pot belly stove, a, a, what do you call it, a, a wood burning stove right here. And we're going to be fixing all these windows, tightening all this up, pointing up all the mortar. This We're going to be closing this in on Monday. Just uh, because we have wood sitting here, we don't want anyone, you know, 
taking advantage of a five figure discount. So anyway, but yeah, don't worry about this uh, attic here. This is just extra. It's just a mess. That's all. It'll all come down. And then, we, but we still got solid planks above. So we got good heartwood upstairs. I don't know what that is. Anybody got a clue? I'm gonna have to pull that down. That looks like an old sign. Anyway, hey, one little thing which is kind of cool. We are taking this half of this window here and it's gonna go sideways. This was one of the original storm windows on the inside of the house, or maybe the outside, I forget. And we're gonna take this and we're gonna hang it sideways. It's gonna be above the archway between the dining room and the kitchen. It's gonna look really cool. I'm not sure what we're gonna do with the glass, but it's gonna be for something special. Anyway, eventually there's gonna be pergola between these two houses going from the deck up there. It's gonna go across and step up. If we don't just punch a hole in the side of the apartment there, we'll make a walk around to the deck right there. And there's a doorway right around the corner. Whew, it's chilly. Yeah, see there's a busted up old doorway up there. Anyway, gonna get the roof replaced here as well. Hello, Mr. Garbage Can. Anyway, so that's it. Pergola going across, or pergola coming out here with the uh, walkway on top of it. That's gonna connect to the garage eventually. And to top it all off, one day, we're gonna be putting a widow's walk on the top of this house. That's gonna be our crowning achievement with this place, is the widow's walk that's gonna go way up there. Oh yeah, it's gonna be mighty cool. Anyway, that's what we got for today. Thanks for tuning in to another hair straightening episode of Browie's Best Mansion. I hope you're warmer than I am right now. But uh, yeah, have a great day. Oh, hey, wait, there's one more thing I wanna show you before we go our separate ways here. I have to keep you with me while I walk around the garbage here. As, you, as, as I'm doing these little speeches, these little recordings, you may see gnomes pop up here and there. Eventually, we're gonna have a lot of fun with gnomes. I mean, we've already started. Thinking about calling this place Gnome Sweet Gnome, as a matter of fact. And we've got Miss Tara and Chris that are, especially Tara, who's planting these gnomes here and there. And they've even created a little area. Oh yeah, check this out. Check this out. <laughs> this is awesome. Yeah. You see this? building a little village they got some they put in moss down here they're building a little, little walkway little gnome guys check this out and they packed in a little there's a little gnome house right there in the side of the bank a little this and that here and there Really cool stuff. All right, that's all I got for today, folks. Once again, thanks for tuning in. We'll talk to you guys next time on another, what, pie eating, snake handling episode of Browie's Mesta Mansion. Love you guys. Bye now.